What's going on guys, Bills here from Achievement Land, and I'm here with Human Fall Flat. This game got a new level, Dockyard, and it has four new achievements. So I'm gonna run you through the level and show you how to get all the achievements. So head over to Extra Dreams and pick Dockyard, and then we could start it up. It's not too hard of a level, and it's gonna take about 25 minutes or so. For the achievements, we have to break all the glass. There's four pieces. We have to swing from the chain to the window. It's very easy. We have to find the hidden boat. I'll show you where it is, and then we have to finish the level. So from the start, just make your way over here and jump up the platforms. Just be careful because they do swing. And just keep climbing up here. Now you're going to see these hooks going around up here. We're going to grab onto one and it's going to bring us down to the next area. All right, now you can let go. Over here, there's some dumpsters. And in front of us, we have the way to go, which is blocked by a piece of glass. So we need to smash it with this dumpster. And this is gonna be the first piece of glass that we need to break for the achievement, which is basically unmissable. And then we have these rings that we need to climb across. It's easy to go across monkey bar style, just do one arm, then the other, and then we can swing to the other side. All right, now to the right, you'll see this lever thing over here. You're gonna pull down and it's gonna drop a chain. And then you wanna grab onto the chain and it's gonna bring you up. And what we wanna do is swing up there and get that box. Now you wanna take this box off and bring it to the other side. And we're going to pull the lever again and drop the chain down, but this time we're not going to get the next box. We're actually going to swing out the window to the right, and that's how we're going to get the achievement. So pull this, get the chain to drop down, and then grab onto it. And as you can see, there's a window, an opening. And what we need to do is swing over that way and just go out the window without using a box. There we go. Now just climb through and we should be good. The achievements are a little delayed, so it should pop in a few seconds or so. So now we have this next area where we have to go through that door. There's the achievement. We have to set up these so we can climb up and get that wooden box and then put it on the button. And then we're gonna move the platform so we can jump across to the other side to the open door. All right, on to the next area. So we have to get through this glass. So what we have to do is go up here. So we're gonna press this button. When it's green, that means the bridge is coming down. 
green, yellow, whatever color it is. So just hit the button and when it's that color, wait for the bridge to come down. Once it's all the way down, we're going to press the button again and we're going to grab onto it and ride it up. And now we can jump off and then we're going to jump across these roofs. And what we want to do is get to that barrel and take it and bring it down because we need it to break the glass. Make sure you don't fall off without this barrel so you don't have to do the whole bridge thing again. Once you drop it down, we need to jump back by the button and bring the bridge down again. And now we need to take the barrel and roll it down into the glass. Make sure you don't drop it down into the water. All right, there we go. And then we'll roll down and break the glass. And this is the next glass that we have to break for the achievement. If you want, you can take the barrel and make sure all the glass breaks just to be safe. And now we can move along. So just continue forward down this bridge and jump up the platforms. Now we're going to swing on this chain over here to the next platform. Alright, now we can continue forward. In this area is our next piece of glass to the right. This is three out of four. So you just want to pick it up and then drop it and that should break it. There we go. Now across on the other side on this boat, there is a wooden box that we need to grab and bring it over. It could be a little tricky to get this box over, but you want to get it like stuck in between and then you can pull it over on the other side. If you push it through on an angle, it should get stuck. I ended up falling and then I just had to walk back over and then grab it. So here it is. It wasn't too bad. Now you want to take this box and bring it over this way. There's some switches up here, so just put the box over here and climb up. Alrighty then, I'm struggling with that box. Alright, so once you get up here, you want to hit the button on the right. Press and hold it, and that's going to raise these swinging hooks. And just wait till it's all the way up. And once it's all the way up, we're going to take this box and go up the stairs over here. Just grab it with one of your arms, and then just keep jumping up the stairs with it. You should be able to pull it up pretty easily. And once you get over here, what you need to do is grab onto the hook while holding the box, and that's going to bring us over to the other side. The other thing you could do is stand on the box and grab the top of the hook, and then you can grab the entryway when you pass by, but it's a lot easier with the box, so we're going to go with the safe, easy way. So just bring this box over here and drop it down, and then we can climb up and go through to the next area. All right, so the first thing you want to do is uh, grab this over here. 
and then we need to press this button over here and stop this thing when it's at the bottom and now we can put this on forklift style it's a little bit of a pain so just make sure it's lined up right and then push it in once you get it in and it's all set we can press the button you want to press it when the one on the right is coming down this way they meet like that and now once it comes back down we can jump on it and then jump to the next one and get to the top we're gonna have to climb up there one more time because there's no checkpoint in this next area and we want to get the hidden boat which is over this way so we're gonna come over here to get the next achievement and you're going to see there's a boat down there that we need to get to. Now what we're going to do is the roll trick. You grab with one arm, let go, grab with the other arm, and just roll. So we're going to roll over to this area over here and get to the boat. All right, now that we're down here, we can jump over to the boat. Just be careful so you don't miss it. There we go. Now that you're in the boat, grab the motor. This way it drives, and that will trigger the achievement. And it should pop eventually. Like I said, they're a little delayed. There we go. Once you have the achievement, you can jump in the water, and that will respawn you. And then we can continue on and finish the level. I was trying to drive the boat a little bit, but I kept getting stuck, so I'm just going to jump off. And there we go. We're back here. So like I said, we have to go up here again, but it's very simple and easy. It's all set up. We don't have to set it up again, thankfully. So just climb back up and go through the window, and then we can do the next area. Alright, so what we need to do is make a path to get across. So we're going to pull this thing over to the side. And we have to ride the hook up. And we have to get a pallet for the forklift. So when the hook comes down, we're going to grab it and ride it up. And then we'll go and grab the pallet for the forklift and put it on the forklift. All right, here's the pallet. Now we can grab it and take it off and put it on the forklift. All right, there we go, it's on. Now what we want to do is raise it up. So we're going to use the lever on the left. Once it's all the way up, we're going to drive it in between the stairs over there and the next platform that we have to jump to this way we have a bridge across and we can get across it's a little annoying driving this thing 
So just uh, turn the steering wheel and then you move the lever on the right forward to go forward. Try to just go a little forward, then adjust the steering wheel and just get over to the other side so that we can put a bridge in between. Alright, that should be good enough. Now we're going to climb up and jump across. Alright, now we're in the next area. The fourth and final glass piece that we need to break for the achievement is in this area on the back wall. So just walk over to it and we're going to pick it up and drop it. There we go, and that should pop the achievement eventually. It's a little delayed, of course. There we go. And now we just have one achievement left, and that's just for beating the level. So we're actually going to skip this puzzle. It's very simple. You just use the weights on them and move the platform to the side, press the button, and then you can go to the other side and go through the door. But you can also just use the roll trick and just go right around here. I think it's very easy to do the roll trick, especially in this spot right here. So just grab with one arm and then roll and then grab with the other arm. Once we get to the middle part, it's going to be very simple. Right, now it's even easier to climb on this wall and then we just need to get to the front of this wall and once you're in the front of the wall you can just drop down because there's a platform below you and when you drop down you're gonna get the checkpoint and now we can continue along so jump onto this boat and we're gonna grab this pole here and we're gonna grab it and jump forward and just by leaning with it, it will move. We want to lean this way and we need to climb towards the tip of it. You could do a monkey bar style or you can even do the roll trick that we just did. It's easy to do monkey bar style though because when you roll on this thing, it moves all over the place. But just go to the tip and then we could jump off to this platform. And then we're going to climb up. We're going to use this thing here, spin it around, and that's going to drop down a chain that we could swing on and make our way up. There we go. Now climb up here to this boat and we have to do the same thing as before with this pole and just make your way to the tip. All right, we're in the final area. This is actually the exit right here. But what we need to do is just open up these doors and then we could jump through the exit. And the switch for this door is up there. So what we need to do is just set up these uh, platforms to jump across to the switch. So first we're gonna drop down this chain and we're gonna get this box to the left. Alright, take this box and drop down with it. And what we need to do is spin this and then we're going to use the box to stop it at a right spot so that it will stay where it is. All 
All right, that looks good. You can make adjustments if you want to. You can push the stick a little or push the box. That looks good. Now we have another one over here and we need to do the same thing. And it's gonna move the one next to it so we can set it up. This one goes the other way though, it drops down. Adjust it a little bit. All right, that should be good. So after you're happy with it, how it is, what we're gonna do is go on the chain that we did before to get the first box and we're gonna swing across. I'm just gonna adjust this a little bit, make it a little higher. All right. I actually could have uh, put them a little lower, but it's fine. So now we're going to drop down this chain again and swing across. Yeah, I probably should have put it a little lower or jumped better, but doesn't matter. I'll get up here. If you want, you could put it a little lower in your game. Come on. All right. So now we're up here and we're going to climb across. And jump to this area. And over here is the switch. So press this and that will open up the exit. You can see it open up over there. And now we're gonna make our way back and jump to the exit and finish the level. And there we go, once you jump through, that will finish the level and give you the achievement and you'll be done with this game again. So that's it guys, that's the achievement walkthrough for the dockyard level. Thanks so much for watching, I hope this video helped you. Leave a like if it did, and I'll catch you guys next time here at Achievement Land. <laughs>